Okay, now we're moving on to Tacoma Blues, which has a few new characteristics that we need to discuss. First of all, it's in 6 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I do da, ba, da, di, ta, ta. It's got that feeling. Um, the other thing that's unusual about it is it's got, instead of a four chord in bar two, it's got a flat seven dominant in bar two. So we're in the key of B flat. So the, the second chord in the song is A flat seven, and then it right back up to B flat again. And of course, these, um, these changes are based on uh, West Coast Blues by West Montgomery, um, and uh, at least the, the head changes for that. The next thing that this one's got is in addition to an approach from above chord, so we're going to approach the four chord, E flat seven, from a half step above. And we're also going to introduce an idea that I call companion minor. And the companion minor is a minor chord, which is a fifth away from a dominant seventh chord. And you can always put them together. So if you've got a bar or two bars of a dominant seventh chord, you can always use the companion minor to uh, go back and forth between. Now, you might want to, in order to get your companion minors really squared away in your head, some people would say it's a 2-5, and it looks like a typical 2-5, but it's not 2 and it's not 5, so I don't call it a 2 and a 5. It's a little bit complicated to call it flat 2 and flat 5, so I just call it approach from above with its companion. That's my way of talking about it. Then the rest of the tune is uh, basically just all dominant seventh chords. And you can apply these, uh, as I do in the soloing, you can apply the uh, companion minor to the melodic content as well. <laughs> 